The idea for a meter dose inhalation device for cannabis came from a, a very deep pain by the medical community and the patients themselves. There was a, a tremendous challenges in actually controlling the dosage of a drug which has of course therapeutic properties but also has psychoactive properties. Uh, one of the types of pain that we are facing quite frequently and it's really hard to control is what we call neuropathic pain. One of the things that, uh, that are basics for patient-doctor relationship is that a doctor knows what they are giving the patients. And I think that until uh, we got a psyche, uh, we haven't been really able to know what we give the patient. Our first device that we went to clinical trials with was uh, roughly 80% printed. Before printing it, we were uh, using CNC machining and uh, all these methods that were very common. Uh, but we found it very slow and expensive and uh, limited. At that point, we recognized the potential and the, and the power that 3D Printer is, is giving us as a company to accelerate through these types of processes. Once we brought the 3D Printer in-house, we had uh, six weeks to finish the design and uh, reach our goals. And not only did we reach our goals uh, on time, we actually made it better. We faced one major challenge, which was the inhalation pattern. Different patients inhaled in different ways. We used 3D printing to design our airflow system uh, in a way which is impossible to do in any other method. Uh, Geometry-wise, this is impossible to do to this day without a 3D printer. Uh, this allows us to control the airflow of our device in a very, very specific manner and achieve uh, very precise dosage. We cut so many corners by developing it in that way and it worked beautifully. It did all that it was intended to do and we, we sailed through the clinical trial with amazing results. For the first time, it takes a cannabis herb and give it to the patient in a way which is comparable to other medications that are used in the market by physicians. The motto at Psyche is don't think, print. So what I mean by that is that by printing it, it actually accelerates your thinking process because you have that object in your hand. So we're pushing our engineers, don't wait for that final CAD design where you're 100% sure. Print throughout the design process, have it in your hand, get that physical uh, interaction with that product while you're thinking and while you're designing it. Don't wait for that and that will accelerate the end result. I would recommend using 3D printing from the very beginning for any med tech company uh, from concept to prototyping to clinical trials, every step of the way uh, can be solved better with a 3D printer.